then after that you should ensure that before you transplant you have to water your your nursery rains to avoid damage on the roots even the main food where you are taking your seedling should be watered then again after after planting you have to water again then uh, for that week you don't want to transplant at least for seven days you can be watering every day then the mama that you to start established you can reduce the amount of water you can just uh, determine if water is still there or you need to irrigate yes mm. on the hardening <coughs> part the hardening process mm -hmm. how long does it take before transplanting hardening hardening it's uh 10 days before mm -hmm. you transplant you have to add in off your seedlings. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> then, uh, <coughs> so after transplanting, you, you should also consider you should consider the spacing that that should be in the main field. For cabbage, mala mala, the main field it should be fifty to. 45 centimeters so the lines the distance between the lines should be 50 centimeters then uh, the distance between the plant should be 45 but for big added varieties it's a 60 by 6 by 60 so then uh, the distance between the crops again 60 then fertilizer application for nursery it's uh, 3 kg if you're using manure the type of manure we all know that uh, seedlings they need nitrogen for them to grow right? mm -hmm. so just to speed up the the, the growth the growth rate of those seedlings you have to apply d compound they need d compound and those manures again the the the, the, the nutrients content they differ Poultry manure got more nitrogen compared to the other the manures. So, madam, that need ni manures in our Is it cow dung or is it feed dung manure or poultry manure? So, it's a 3 kg if you are using manure per meter squared. 3 meter, I mean 3 kg per meter squared. Then, uh, for the compound, it's a 5 60 grams. Per meter squared. Then after transplanting, that's when the spacing your main field. For onion, it's uh, 30 centimeters between the the lines. Then uh, between the plants, it's uh, five to seven centimeters. So you don't need a lot. Then for for tomatoes, it's a uh, Na, na, it's uh, 90 centimeters between the distance the distance between the lines it's uh, 90 centimeters then for for the distance between the the plants it's a uh, 60 then for the fertilizer application women feel dwarding danga it's 100 kg then i am fish back 100 kg that's for one hectare <coughs> if you are applying a d compound in uh, one hectare of cabbage it's a uh, hundred k i mean 800 kg so if you you are if you you were to convert it into bags more to divide by 50 so that it gives you the number of bags that you, you need in one hectare then uh, for top dressing fertilizer you can use urea which is a uh, 100 kg and it you can apply it twice three weeks after transplanting then after one month after transplanting again then uh, even for ammonia i mean for for onion you have to use ammonium nitrate you have to use ammonium nitrate and you have to use two to three weeks to use ammonium nitrate. Then after four 
four to six week again and some of it are ammonium nitrate before you transplant then for the pests that try that attack our crops for garbage to agenda part to dam on the back moth babama aphids kwabanama ama cutworms those are the mostly common pests that attack our garbage then for tomatoes we, we have a leaf miner or this one at the sit absolute then we also have red spider mites we have aphids even caterpillars the cutworms they also attack tomatoes so for those i talked about the chemicals that we you can use you are given some alternatives like for organically or Ma biological measures that you can use to control those pests like for neem tree what else neem ginger tree, benchili, chili. garlic even aloe vera you can use all those yes then for insecticides like for tooth absoluta you can use amectin benzo then uh, you can also use you can use um, you can use then denim can also be used when it comes to madam on the back mouth. even amprigo can be used so there are many ngamwaya muma agro shops to be able to guide you to say this is the type of chemical that you can use and when applying you shouldn't just uh, limit yourself to one chemical ama pest na ina lesa mukuba resist kuriya ama pen ama pen as a result chale ko so it's better to change every time you use it mwa change ako mwa fa ko yindi eyo mwa mwa spray mind no to don't shock na bonse ya spray na yindi then for within but it and the my importance ya within then um na spray ni na ena it's important to monitor before you scream, why some let them on my mama which is like if it was stuck in my plumber I'm even to say I think there is a problem the ribs have been consumed by something so we could a mama so that's why she went to apply ama chemicals and when applying it is important to apply early in the morning or late in the after late in the afternoon it's not it's not only the ama pesticide but also fertilizer should be applied early in the morning or late in the afternoon the reason why they always encourage to apply fertilizer in the morning it's because when you apply in the afternoon the temperatures they are high and once the leaves are exposed to higher temperatures meaning the stomatas will be closed as a result they will affect the absorption of ama chemicals or ama nutrients so I'm a plant that is some cover stressed as a result that looks to absorb my chemicals. So it is important to apply in the morning or late in the afternoon. Then we can come. Then someone talked about the, the pests for our orchard that side. So by Sarah and the quad Bama feeds, I said I'm not so sure, mm. but uh, I tried to to go through my notes that yes even aphids they attack ama ama fruit trees so they are aphids they are also swallowtail caterpillars that attack mostly ama 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 fruit trees or ama citrus trees so now how can we know that these trees they are being affected so that's why i can learn that like for diamond back moth you can so that this they are being attacked by just seeing the the leaves being consumed kai madam on jet tachu ama nana ama leaves ya cabbage so it is a cabbage to put your life attack by madam on back so you be able to see mwe be ne mamunati ichi de ngere fi ni madam on back back moth or my grasshoppers or to my aphids it will be madam ka time ka Okay, I think it's not the leather sort of thing. Talk about my fruits, it's... Yes. Uh, they, 